Apple showed off a bunch of new features, coming to the iPhone at its annual Worldwide Developers Conference in Cupertino. Now let's talk about iOS, the world's most powerful mobile operating system. Yes, it's iOS 13. First up, a long-awaited feature. We are bringing dark mode to iOS. All right. Check it out with a gorgeous, dark appearance. It's really fantastic. And there was another feature users have wanted for a long time. You can swipe. Apple teased a few new other features as well. Time synced lyrics. Just type what you want and reminders will understand when and where to notify you. Maps is getting a whole new redesign as well. Here's our old map and here is the new map. We've also added a couple of very useful new features like favorites where I can add the places I go every day for quick and easy access. This is my favorite part. Turn your phone and hold on tight. Smoothly move down the street. Apple also showed off a few new ways it's gonna let users control their privacy and data. This can be convenient, but it also can come at the cost of your privacy. And so now we have the solution. It's called Sign In with Apple. You can choose to share your actual email address or you can choose to hide it. And when you do, we'll create a unique random address that forwards to your real address. A lot of love for random addresses here. And that's good news because we give each app a unique random address. And this means you can disable any one of them at any time when you're tired of hearing from that app. Messages is getting some new features, including a way to use photos or Memoji to identify yourself in iMessage. Speaking of Memoji, those are getting upgraded too, with additions like lipstick, jewelry, hats, and custom stickers created from your Memoji. The camera is getting improved lighting effects. You'll be able to apply photo effects to videos, and you can finally rotate videos. The Photos app is getting a redesign and some new features too. You can simply pinch to zoom out and see a bunch of photos, or you can zoom in to see more detail. So today is DubDub, -Dub, and Photos knows I go to DubDub -Dub every year. So now, it's showing me all of my dub dubs from the past. AirPods users will be able to share what they're listening to, while CarPlay is getting a pretty big overhaul. Where you can now have your music next to your maps, and you still have room for Siri smart suggestions. But there were a whole lot of features that Apple didn't even talk about. Take a look at the screen. There's both a Wi-Fi selection and control center and a silence unknown callers. Hopefully, that means that iPhone will be able to join Wi-Fi networks without going through settings, and we'll have a way to deal with annoying spam calls. What did you think? What features are you most excited to try out? Let us know in the comments.